We also have a detailed side panel. In the old app, um, this was a model dialog that blocked data entry while it looked at things like the history, uh, the audit log, the setting in max, and so on. So now we have this as a always visible um, side panel, which allows you to kind of look at history, look at the audit log while you enter data. Um, so that should also help in terms of making this information more accessible. So, so let's have a look. So now when you enter data, you can go and click the view details button to bring up the side panel. Here you can see we have information about the data elements, the description code, um, the element ID, carry option combo ID, which is going to be helpful for implementers admins. You can mark a follow up uh, by clicking this button. There's a comment field. You can put in a comment about the value. You can go and set min max limits. So if you want to constrain the absolute min and max values for this, you can go ahead and save save the limits. There's also a nice history chart which shows the last 13 values. So they can see the previous values and to, to kind of in the, to kind of figure out if the new value is reasonable or not. And finally, we have a new audit log uh, section where you can basically look at the changes to this value over time. So you can see when and who and what change have taken place for this particular value in a nice and, and easily readable interface like this. And again, you can also tab along um, the values and you see this, this side panel basically updates as you scroll through the form like this. 